the Prince of Wales will react with fury after footage from an infamous interview with Diana, Princess of Wales, which shamed BBC journalist Martin Basher appeared in Harry and Meghan's new Netflix docuseries. Prince William said previously the programme, which was first broadcast in 1995, should never appear on screens again. Sources close to William said he would feel dismayed his brother had blatantly gone against his wishes with another source claiming that it shows just how little regard there is from the Sussex camp. One source told the Mirror, he, William, will be rightly furious about it. He couldn't have been clearer in the past and this is one thing he would have thought he and Harry were aligned on. Sadly once more it shows the gulf between the two brothers couldn't be wider. Three episodes of the couple's documentary were streamed on Netflix this morning. Halfway through the first episode, clips are shown of Diana speaking in the controversial Panorama interview. Especially in that Panorama interview. I think we all now know that she was deceived into giving the interview. But at the same time she spoke the truth of her experience. Read about a drug dealer's threat after ramming police cars A report by Lord Dyson published in May 2021 found BBC had covered up Mr Basho's deceit in obtaining the interview, falling short of high standards of integrity and transparency. The journalist was in serious breach of the BBC's producer guidelines when he faked bank statements and showed them to Diana's brother Earl Spencer to gain access to the princess, the report said. In a damning statement issued after publication of the report, William said, It is my firm view this panorama program holds no legitimacy and should never be aired again. It effectively established a false narrative which, for over a quarter of a century, has been commercialised by the BBC and others. William added, It is my view that the deceitful way the interview was obtained substantially influenced what my mother said. The interview was a major contribution to making my parents' relationship worse and has since hurt countless others. It brings indescribable sadness to know the BBC's failures contributed significantly to her fear, paranoia and isolation that I remember from those final years with her. The Duke of Sussex said he felt deeply concerned journalistic practices like those used by Mr Basher were widespread today and were bigger than one outlet, one network, or one publication. He said, the ripple effect of a culture of exploitation and unethical practices ultimately took her life. The BBC apologised to the royal family. BBC Director General Tim Davey vowed the BBC would never show the programme again nor licence it to other broadcasters. Royal experts were quick to spot use of the footage. Robert Jobson tweeted, Prince Harry has used footage from hashtag Diana Panorama interview in a Netflix documentary. Prince William said after Dyson report it should not be aired again. Harry said, the ripple effect of a culture of exploitation and unethical practices ultimately took her life. Dickie Arbiter tweeted, how come at Netflix were allowed to use footage from hashtag Diana hashtag Panorama interview in documentary? 20 minutes into the first episode hashtag Harry talks about mother and compares hashtag Meghan to his mum saying she has the same confidence, passion and warmth. Meanwhile, Netflix has offered viewers a first look at the second volume of episodes for